Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel. I am Imashri. In today's video, I will explain SharePoint calculated column get month from date. Let me explain you with an example. Assume that I have a SharePoint list which has a date column. Now based on the date column, we will create a calculated column to get a month name, month number, year and also the both month and year for this particular date. Like example, I have shown you here. Now let's do practically by creating a calculated column for all this. Open your SharePoint site. This is my home page of SharePoint site. I will navigate to the list. This is my SharePoint list regarding product transaction details. This list has a date column like product supply date. Now based on this date column, I need to get a month name for this. So I will create a calculated column for this. Click on add column. Click on see all column types, then click on next button. I'll give name as product supplied month. Choose type as calculated. Now void the formula equal to text. I'm providing the text function. Now choose the date column. Comma. Now we need a monthly. So provide forum. Then close the syntax. We need uh, we need in single line of text only because we need month name. Then click on the OK button. See now based on this date column, we are getting the month name like 11 November. Now, to get a month number, click on add column, see all column types, click on next button, provide a column name as product supplied month number, choose calculated, provide a text function, choose column name comma we need only month number so only 2m i'll choose number then click on the ok button see now based on this date column we are getting the month number now i will create a calculated column to get a year Oops. click on add column see all column types Click on next button. Provide the column name as product supplied year. Choose calculated. The formula use the same text function. Provide column equals. Then click, then click on the answer should be number column. So I choose it, then click on the OK button. See now from this date column, it is providing me the year. Now I need both. Now from, now from this date column, I need both month number and year also. So I will create a calculated column to get it. Add column, see column types, click on next button. Provide the column name as product supplied month and year. Choose calculated. Now provide the text function in formula bar. Choose the column. I need both month number and year. Close the syntax. Now my answer should be in single line of text. Then click on the OK button. See. See now. 
based on this date column we got the month and year by creating a calculated column see 11 8 2022 8 11 and 2022 See now, based on this date column, we got the month name, month number, year, and also the month, both month and year. This is how we can create a calculated column for all this. I hope you guys like this video. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to our channel to get free video tutorials on SharePoint Online, Power Apps, Power Automate, and Power BI. Thank you.